Okay guys, we are here to do a spacey score and a ranking on Marvel's Ghost Rider, guys. Yeah, we've got to get into some of these Marvel tables. Um, wow, this has got some crank and rock. It's a nice feel already, guys. Let's smash straight into this. The spirit of vengeance rides again. Yes. <laughs> There's so much going on on this table. And I love those Satan devil sounds. And just the, the whole look of this table, guys. I mean, it, it gives me a bit of ACDC vibes, obviously, with the rock going on as well. Um, the colouring gives me that sort of that feel. But this is... Uh, very nice, the table layout's really unique. Straight away, like this first impression, say it's... And the show begins. Get the Ghost Rider on the motorbike going up there. Whoops, just missed that. Keep the bike going. Got a big smile on my face. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, let's try to backhand Satan. The lock is lit. Ah. <laughs> I, I, I know I'm not going to say a lot in this game because I am focused on everything that's going on to track in this ball because this table is pretty busy so the ball disappears a little and that's okay but it does require a little bit of concentration oh. Get through there that's it yep got the lock a nice way of locking the ball there too. Now you have the skill shot over here, this top one. This should be max, yeah? Nah, just missed it. It's a nice little multi ball. There we go. Try and keep this one a little. A jump. Oh, wow. No good saving balls, guys, if you're just going to lose it straight away. Oh, yeah, right. Uh, death race. We're on the death race. Shoot into the lit hole. Oh, I just... My grandfather would not be pleased. No. Well, that's a strange call out, though. I want to get those double combos. <laughs> I've got your back, John. Thank you. There's nothing better than when you get a combo 2x, 5x, and the, the call out marries up with it really nice to make you want to get it. 
happens on my eight ball champ. Get two X, five X. Sounds so cool. So I'm moving around like I'm doing a jazzercise class. <laughs> oh, hey, oh, whoops, what I do? I lost one soul there. Ah, man. <laughs> it's hard to keep up. It's hard to keep up. It's an onslaught of, onslaught of sensors, guys. We're going again. We're going again. Vengeance has a name. You are way top. The Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider, nice. Hit the skill shot. Yes, I actually, oh, I turned up the voices a little on this table. I usually have them down a little, but the Satan's sounds so awesome. <laughs> uh, oh. My grandfather would not be pleased. Uh, Missed. Oh, whoa! I've got your back, Johnny. Whoa, 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 whoa! It looked like it jumped over the top. There's one thing that Zen doesn't put in their tables is a good solid Z bounce, you know, with balls actually leaving the table. But that actually looked like it did leave the table. I'm not sure if that was supposed to happen. Oh. My grandfather would not be pleased. Uh, I don't like that ball out call out. That's the only call out I'm not keen on. I didn't even look at the skill that time. Shooting on the middle there, I've missed it. Awesome. Throw the orb. Has a deal for you. Okay, jump shots. Alright. You can't be me on my own turf. Ah! Damn it. Game over. Guys, one more. <laughs> I'm sorry. I only one more here. Ah! Didn't check the skill again. Man. I don't, again, I don't mind that. I don't mind those sort of challenges. Sort of can be avoided depending on how you play, right? And I don't mind that. Something to keep you on your toes rather drain down the middle than down the sides, personally. And I don't know how long I have played. Um, the game's felt short and it's going to be interesting to see if they were short games or not. And I think that's because it just feels like that's a nice orbit shot. Wow. Um, ah. Feels like there's just so much going on and it's just cranking in your face and you're just flowing with it. It's one of those things, right? Like if there's lots happening, time goes fast. Wow, man. I've got your back, Woo, lucky, because that was bad on my behalf. 
this bomb head. Extra ball is lit. lit. Where is it? Oh, it's right on the devil. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, 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 okay. Can I get it? Can I actually get the extra ball? I'll go the ramp. Oh, shit. <laughs> Grab. Grab. I've got to get it in there. Ah. Yes. There we go. Surprise, bonehead. <laughs> Surprise, bonehead. I love it. Oh. That was a little brutal on the outline. Shoot again. God. It's tough getting this top one. It's just ricochets off there. Way shoot again. Going now, I must admit. Missed the lock. It's cool to drop it in there actually behind that little target in front of him. Just trying to get out in that orbit. Missed it. It again, gotta get real shallow. <laughs> wow, I'll try, guys. That's way too shallow. The lock is lit. Aye, 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 aye. Well, it jumps in there so fast, I, I didn't even see it. Jeez, I can get that ramp shot, I just can't get that left orbit. Get it there either. Oh, I should have. Well lost. Uh. <laughs> you get that top one hard on. Oh, yeah, it's not going to be enough. Really hard with a button, obviously, with a plunger would be awesome. Oh man, Greg, come on. Come on. The lock is lit. Yep, got it. Ball locked. It locked. That's a great shot, that actually. Oh, what am I. Oh, I can see where I was going. A really nice shot to lock those balls. Okay, okay, guys. Let's uh, turn down this crank and music a minute. And let's give this a spacey score. All right, guys, so yeah, you can probably tell from my commentary that this was just a frantic all out game of pinball and uh, really, really did enjoy it. Uh, but we got to give it a spacey score and we'll see how it stacks up in the different criteria So we're going to start with a the theme. We're in the Marvel Universe here, but again, it's all about translating the particular 
element into a pinball table and does it translate well, I think this whole concept with the Ghost Rider and everything that comes together on this table is awesome. It's, a, it's an awesome thing, um, without a doubt. And all these elements, it's just so cool. I love that. And yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a um, I'm gonna give it theme such a cool theme. I'm giving it a ten, guys. I'm giving it the the theme a ten. Atmosphere. Okay, so atmosphere like this is a cranking, grungy atmosphere going on in this game. Very different from some of the other pins that we've been playing. Um, it, it's it's cool with the devil in there as well and and the ghost rider himself and all of that it all brings together its own unique atmosphere in this particular genre so yes i like it i like it a lot um yeah it's good it's either an eight or a nine i think i'm gonna err on i'm gonna err on an eight but it's a strong it's a strong eight all right, layout and realism. This is a really good, uh, interesting, and probably when we look at shots later. But this this is a, a really nice layout, and uh, you know, as a pin table, if this was actually a real pin with all the things things and features that it has, and the way to lock the balls and that. Again, it's very reminiscent um, of just some of the complexities of you know something like an AC to DC which isn't a complex table but you know what I mean it just feels like you, you know you could do all these things and trigger off the ghost rider and get that spinning and all that stuff so I really do like this layout I like it a lot um, it's pretty unique it's going to score high here so this is going to be a nine on layout it's, it's awesome table artwork well what can I say um, this artwork blows me away this table looks awesome uh, chains on here it's just the coloring everything it's a little it's a little bleak on that artwork just in the middle of the table to the right that's the only area I picked up that I thought no nah. everything else though, is done so nicely it's just it's beautiful we've got the skid marks tire tracks here it's just there's just been a lot of care done in this artwork so that bottom right might just bring it down just a tad um, which is a shame from a straight 10 so I, I, I will give it a 9 but it's 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 not far off from being just like ultimately perfect in terms of art from my perspective <laughs> so that's just crazy good animations are really good um, definitely with the ghost rider itself the devil here moving around um, yeah I, I, I like the animations and yeah this they're, they're strong up there so i think that's a good and all this this ghost of the fire effects gonna give animations an eight uh graphical effects um again probably some of that fire and stuff you could put down as those effects you know and in here and that which is really nicely done uh i think overall probably a seven on the effects now lighting lighting on this table is excellent um, bright dark depth and, and it just looks really nice and yeah I can't fault the lighting in terms of you know what Zen's engine can produce um, this is right up there I think in terms of uh, you know I mean there are better lighting techniques you know out there in the, in the industry as such uh, even in the community but this is very very <coughs> very good so I think it deserves a 10 if we're ranking these end tables I think it deserves a 10 for lighting now DMD well this is an interesting one guys because it's obviously the old style DMD which is a bit of a shame this table would rock if this DMD was uh, will rock even further if this DFD was redone in the latest graphics and effects and stuff it would just add another dimension to the game it doesn't have that what it does do well though it does that that 90s style DMD you know everything that's moving around on it the things that come up and it it works like a DMD should in a 90s pin uh, it just gets knocked down a little bit because it's obviously not going to compete with uh, the latest DMDs but you know other than that it's all sweet it's got some cool animation effects even now 
So yeah, so I, I it's going to be up there for the older style DMD. So I think it deserves. I think it deserves a seven. Okay, because it's not going to get there without all the color graphics and all the rest of it. The later ones, I wish. I, I hope they come back and actually add a color DMD. That'd be awesome. Okay, music. Okay, music's cranking. It's absolutely cranking. Um, Look, it's a table that, if I'm honest, if you played it again and again and again, there's going to be a point where you're going to get, your, your, your sensories are going to be like, just like, okay, enough. <laughs> Need to get out and, and, into something else, which is a less of an onslaught. Uh, but it, it's cranking, it's really good music, and it suits the table, it suits when you're playing it. Um, I'm going to give it an eight. I'm going to give it an eight. Uh, sound effects, sound effects were nice, um, funnily enough, when I think about them, then they weren't, they weren't really com coming out at me a, a lot, so from that point of view, I don't know why, actually, I have to look back at the footage to see what that is, but it, it's about, a, it's about a seven, I think, for sound effects, again, not mind-blowing, um, but it added where it needed to, so that, that's cool. Now, call-outs, a call-out's an interesting one. Uh, I really do like Satan and uh, and his, his his the way he speaks and his call outs. I didn't like the ball loss call out, but that was about it to be fair. And all the rest were were very good. So I think to be fair and with the effects on the Satan's voice and all the rest of it, I'm going to push this one up. And uh, I think it deserves an eight because I really do like listening to the call out. So it deserves an eight. Okay, flow's an interesting one. Um, I've obviously, so much going on in this table. It does still flow really well, though. Uh, so I didn't feel like it was too clunky. I mean, just given sheer amount, it's actually pretty impressive. Uh, and so, you know, it's not super flowing, though. But still, I think if you get really skilled at this, then there's no reason why it wouldn't. So I'm going to put it up there, guys. This is going to be an 8 on flow, actually. This table's actually surprised me a little because uh, it's not one of the new new releases right but it's a cranking absolutely cranking table all right shot interest again without a doubt there's so many different shots here to play um you know you're chasing yourself trying to look for where you're going with the ball and and then with the with the flippers you've got you know you use those flippers you know seldomly but when you do it you know just changes the the shots up and getting that ball lock is really nice oh wow Shot interest is really good. I feel like it would be remiss of me not to give it a nine, actually. <laughs> wow. Challenge. Challenge is great. It's a great challenging table. Wow. I'm so surprised, actually, with my ratings before going into this game, guys, because I didn't know if this would, would really hold up to, to some of the best, but this really, really has. I have to just be honest in, in terms of my feelings on it, at least and uh, the challenge was awesome um, you know the shots are those shots are really hard to make and stuff there's just a real lot of interesting stuff going on there and it made it hard it was difficult and oh, do I give it a nine I think I have to I have to give it a nine on challenge as well guys giving a, a nine on challenge all right physics feel okay now this is this is also interesting because this is an older style one I think whatever they did with the physics translation with this was very good. Um, it does feel a little light, uh, um, but it's nothing that got me feeling like, oh, you know, it's all wonky or it's too fast ping pongy or, you know, marble physics. It wasn't that. It wasn't quite up there with the, the latest tables, though, I think, um, when I've been giving those an eight. So I think we have to drop that to a seven. But otherwise, it's it's a solid feel. Fun factor, I had a smile on my face from ear to ear most times. Uh, it's, yep, it's definitely fun, heaps of fun, uh, and so I'm giving it an 8. It's good, great fun. Now, replayability. Now, this is definitely one to come back to. I, I wonder how long it, well, you could keep going on it. I think it's going to be always one that, if I have people over and stuff, I'm putting this table on, right? It's, gonna, it's like one of the set. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's, it's got that. Um, yeah, I wonder, like, just constantly playing it, how how it would hold up. So we'll see, I guess. But for now, replayability is is high, and I yeah, I've got to give it an eight, guys. You've got to give it an eight. 
Uh, and now the space is X Factor. Uh, I think with the layout, some of the things going on with the layout, just the, the again, just everything coming together on this table and just making it feel like it's such a fun game. It's got, it's got an X Factor. It's got an X Factor for sure. And I think it deserves, and, and with the bike animation and stuff, and just these graphics, just awesome. So, oh man, it's going to get punched up even more. I think uh, my X Factor on this, it's going to go six, but I think I'll go five. Yeah, there's five. There's enough like individual elements that have been ranked highly already. But on top of that, um, yeah, it's just got something that you feel like you've got to compare. I love the way the the with the lighting, we talk about this with the lighting, but with all the inserts flash and that, and, and when you're doing certain things, it's really, really cool. All right, guys, well, that ends up with a rather surprising space. Well, what's surprising for me, Spacey's score for this table, we've got it ranked. It's going to head up there into the list. Let's see where it rates there. And um, wow, what a lot of fun. Great kickoff to the Marvel series. We've got plenty more to do in here, but we're going to mix it up. We're going to walk around the other table packs a bit, guys. So if you're interested in seeing more of these videos, these ranked videos, and see where these tables are, then uh, make sure you subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, give it a thumbs up if you like it, and leave a comment below. I'd like to hear your feelings on this table as well. Okay, guys, until next time, keep flipping. Ciao for now.